All right, now you have get in front of, of my screens here. Um, I'm going to show you how to actually you get your domain after you have a register in Hostgator. You put your domain in Hostgator and then you have come to in this platform. Okay, so through here, after you add on the domains, you have to you have to go to this part, uh, software and service, quick install, and after that you will get into here. So I have just bought a domain where it is called Recurring Revenue Machines, and then when I want to install that, uh, uh, just uh, simply put the email like info recurring revenue revenue machines dot net. All right. The block title is not really important, but of course you can just put your domain on it. All right. Or you just simply put proper title, right? So if you put, want to put review, also can, or and a bonus, that's okay. It depends on what you want going to do, right? And this one normally I will put admin because uh, we are doing launch checking, and uh, when we come to create our cash machines, we div we definitely will use our pain name, right? We don't use normally we don't use our real name behind. So just like Taylor Jamin. Okay, so this is my pain name. Then go ahead and install the WordPress. So now we wait for uh, the install. It takes time. So we just wait for it. Okay, yes. This is complete. And then just click over here. Oh yeah, I just want to make sure with you this C panel I'm using from Hostgator. And now you can see this is the admin area. After that, you have to just click this link and then you must remember the username and the password here, right? But definitely after that, I will just change the password, right? Because I'm recording this down and then after that, of course, I will change my credential, right? So now you can see, I just copy and paste. Okay, just log in. So you can see just now the title that you have set is below there. Okay. Right now, I will going to show you how to uh, find teams and what kind of team is uh, really suitable to create cash machines, which is proper teams. And the first thing first is you have to be clear that the teams doesn't really need to be a complicated one, and just simple. And then they have two features, three features, then it's already enough, right? So now we're going to hunt the teams, hunt for the correct teams. When after you have setting up your WordPress, right? There's a few teams already in here, but if you are not interested with them and you want to change it to another one, just go ahead and find a real one. All right, or maybe if you have already purchased a team, for example, like Genesis team, okay, you just go and just go to add a new one and upload the team. All right, you just choose your file here. If not, you want to save your cost, you just go ahead and choose the teams. You say you want to add a new one. Alright, and then the feature popular and latest one. At first, I will use the filter to filter out what kind of uh, criteria that the teams that I want. Alright, so I'll uh, choose be it to be uh, this black color or blue color. And normally, I will just use two columns. And if the features, these are uh, custom menus. This is not um yes custom custom menus and. Yes, uh, subjects is not really that important, so I will just click few those, right? And then they are just simply to give you uh, that the criteria that you really want. Okay, so there's a lot of teams, free teams over here. You so you can just either choose one that which to fit your criteria, uh, to fit your cash machines. But for me, all right, I feel good teams I've been using for all my cash machines here. So uh, one is Auto Team, all right? Okay, and this one, this is normally what I use to uh, create my cash machines. So I just click install, and we'll go to into the setting now. We make sure that you get a coffee or water because this process to set up the website will be a bit long. So make sure you just enjoy, all right. And then after that, we are just going customize, all right. So site identity, all right. Normally we will just delete this headline or normally I won't put it, all right. So after that, you just uh, go back and then you just 
see front page here your latest post yes correct and then avatar do not display avatar or display this depends on you if it's not issue and if logo if you want to put a logo inside you just directly go to the, their website okay the vendor jv page and then you just copy down their uh, image uh, with a dot png file and then you just select the image and then you upload here and now i'll just simply do it for you and to let you see over here okay for example like channel ranger right so for that you can just put here and let's go back and just start okay if you have twitters then you just put twitters okay and, uh, facebook Google, Pinterest, all right, YouTube important one. All right, and then after that, I'll go back and see this rectangular columns. All right, you might probably cannot use it because if you want to use this, and then you might have to um just go ahead and purchase this uh, teams for Pro one. Right, so you can have this authority to to put a header image to change the fonts, right? To change colors as well. So if shows full post on blog, yes, and then as a link, I will just put zero. Okay, and then I come over here. Comment display. Normally, I will just um deselect all. Okay. After that, yes, custom CAS. Normally, I'll just put my domain here, okay, my URL here, and then I'll just put some HTML code over here, right? So that uh, I'll make this uh, clickable, right? Like anchor text. Then after that, I'll just create my menu. Also, extend this page into back and menu. Okay, I'll just create my menu. Okay, for first one menu one, just simply if you want to put another one, it's also can. You may put three or four, or two or maybe you should put a Hello Kitty as your sign. Okay, Kitty, and this doesn't matter. All right, but for me, it's just simple stuff, and you just put create menu, and normally we'll put this uh, primary one. All right, and then just get out. And then and after that, oh yeah, widget parts is normally I will remove this meta text part and I will remove this. I just try to make my team as simple as that. All right, so just don't try to make it too complicated because it is not user friendly when when they come over your website. They will see oh, why this website is too complicated to navigate. So we don't want that. All right, just make it simple and clean and pure contents everything is just simple and then they can easily to find what they want in your cash machines and after that setting up on my website i just save and publish all right so after that i'll just cross it uh, and then you can see result here all right so this is result here okay when after you you just this is when after you have upload your logo and this is when you have put your twitter's facebook icon uh, and then the icon will be show here if you didn't put and then they will never show so um all right this is how i setting up the teams where this have generated me a lot of money and been using this a year right and i found this team is quite useful because it is uh, mobile friendly as google have mentioned they are more preferred on those websites have this mobile friendly features on the website I normally use this team to rank higher than my other competitors. Okay, but then of course you can try to find another team, test it whether which one is really suitable to, for you to use it. Okay, and I'll show you the another teams that I normally use is twenty twelve is the one of the teams that I prefer. All right, if not, then twenty ten or general press. All right. Okay, now our next session is going to find the plugin. All right. I will see you in the next video. Bye.